Good morning. It's uh, Sunday, 9.35 in the morning. It's March 31st, can you believe it? Just up in the Halliburton area here. Got about I had a good five or six inches of snow last night. And I'm going to do a little video to remind myself that winter can be both beautiful and annoying at the same time. So it's actually not that cold out. It's probably, you know, minus one or around freezing. This is in my old car here. It's a 11 year old SUV. I'm just going to clean off the car. Sure. For anyone used to snow, this is uh, completely really boring. But you know, if you lived, let's say, in uh, Africa or India, the Caribbean, you probably never cleaned snow off a car. The defrost is running. These little things here, where the spray comes out, are really important to clean off. This is going to melt pretty fast. Okay. Almost there. Frost is on the back, it's still working. Okay. There we go, we're almost done. There's my little uh, scuba guy, remind me of the warmer days. Okay. We're off this window here. Caught it just all locked up. Uh, so, let's get checked. Super safe. Let me just double check this lock. Good. Okay, back to the beast. Kick off the old boots. Let's see how we're doing here. It's just gonna melt pretty fast. the first person out today because I just went for a walk and there are some tracks but there's a bit of a hill here and uh, I still have snow tires on and this is a four-wheel drive vehicle so I'm hoping it's not an issue okay put the rear wipers everything is good okay Yeah, it's exactly zero degrees outside. So my guess was pretty good. You can hear that little bit of thumpity thump. Let's have a look that way. No one coming. No one coming this way. So we're driving. They don't. They sort of plow this road. The municipality. Okay, so we're heading out the road called Pine Lake Road. And up here is a beautiful little river that connects Cranberry Lake, which is sort of to the north, east, and Eagle Lake, to Pine Lake, which is to the right. And then there's two other lakes, Grass Lake and Maple Lake. So we'll just have a little peek here. You can see the river. Quite uh, beautiful. And if you pan over this way, you can have a look at it out the window here. It's nav not navigable to uh, uh, upstream. There's rapids, um, and which we've walked through. Uh, but down river, uh, it is. And so this is a little hill. This is going to be much of an issue today. It's had a bit of a trouble getting up here, but just keep going. That's the key to winter and snow. Same thing if you're driving on the beach, of course. Just don't stop. So 
so there's that. The roads up ahead should be in good shape. There's an old car, you can hear it creaking away. are so this is Eagle Lake Road if you make a left about 10 kilometers is Sir Sam's Inn which is a ski hill and a little resort uh, on a beautiful lake so now we're just driving down Eagle Lake Road I'm just going to probably stop the video when when I've shown you uh, the, um, the river that leads from Pine Lake to the next lake, which is Grass Lake. You can see it from the uh, road quite well. So we're just driving along here, doing the speed limit, 80 clicks. The roads are in pretty good shape, wet. tell you, the uh, Halliburton area, the people that look after the roads, do a phenomenal job. Like, you know, there's rarely a pothole. Uh, like I bike a lot. They are really good. And in the wintertime, they're, they're, it's like this, you know, it's Sunday morning, 9.30, and um, they're in good shape. section here. Uh, there's a little village called West Guilford, uh, which is, uh, you know, uh, uh, one little restaurant, a gas station, or a garage, a really good little kind of country store. So if we go to the right, actually let's, let's do a little uh, tour of West Guilford. Here we go, or Guilford I should say. Right, so there's the uh, the garage, and then to the right here is this sort of little restaurant called the West G Pizza and Grill. So when I cleaned off the car uh, not that many minutes ago, uh, we were on the other side of this lake. So I'm just gonna stop so you can have a look. So that's where we were over there. Uh, I'll just stop here. And uh, just sort of below that hill is where the cottage is. The lake is uh, 1.8 kilometers long. There's no road that goes around. This one to my right here doesn't uh, take you around. It's a dead end. So we're just going to kind of, this is a little store here. And we'll do a little uh, pulling you turn here. It's the West Guilford Shopping center. It's not a store. It's got everything. Absolutely everything. Uh, coin laundry across the street. Uh, there's a tourist store further down which is closed this time of year. And now we're heading back. This road that we're on is called the Canassus uh, Road. And um, it's about, I'd say, my guess is 30, 40 kilometers to Canassus I can never say it, Canas, Canassus Lake, and that's where all the super beautiful, expensive cottages are in um, Halliburton. That's the money area. This is this area is a mixture of cottages and locals. So we're gonna just see. Here's the sign. Halliburton is 14 kilometers to the left. Carner Vaughan is to the right. And here are the fantastic people that take care of the roads and keep everybody safe, right here. Plow, Salter, uh, they have, like, I guess, like a little coffee break. So, now we're on the road to Carner Vaughan. This is the 118. This will take you all the way over to the Muskokas, which are about, I don't know, 70, 80 kilometers away. 
and to the north of us, here's the river I want to show you right here. See the river there? Just to the right. You see it there. Another shot coming up. Another view. So now this is Grass Lake. It's a, it's a shallow, grassy lake. And you can see the lake right there. And there's a guy on a snowmobile right over here. Right on the ice, even though it's sort of melting. And I'll go back to the center between here. There's Grass Lake, there's the sign. the road to Hannah in Hawaii. I've done a video there. There's the skinny guys right there. Uh, but it, it, it's a pretty area. Very hilly. Uh, a lot of hiking trails. Um, there's a uh, small trail on one of the hills, sort of uh, on the next lake over, where you can hike up and there's a lookout. It's quite beautiful. It's probably right, right over there. As a, as a cyclist, I uh, I really have learned these roads. I mean, very, there's not that many of them, so in the summer you kind of kind of kind of do them all in the area. So this is this to the right is the end of Grass Lake, and that river that you see right there, that right there, that takes you to uh, the next lake, which is called Maple Lake. Well, I'm going to probably stop the video soon. But why don't we just do one other little um, a little side trip here. Let's go to the Stanhope Airport. It's not very far. And I'll stop the video there. There's a beautiful little church here on the corner. See this? And uh, and it's, uh, Maple Lake United Church. Look at the uh, tombstones with the snow uh, in the graveyard. Uh, so we'll come down this road here. The, the back roads that are not, um, you know, that, that are like this uh, are very popular with the cyclists here in the summer. So up here at the airport is a parking lot. And so what I've noticed is some groups will come or individuals park there, uh, take your bikes out, and then uh, cycle. So here's the, here's the river that leaves um, uh, uh, Maple Lake. So let's just go over to the airport, and I'll pull you there. So here's the airport here. Um, the Ontario government sort of uh, uh, forestry emergency helicopter center is up here and there's the airport and it's looking uh, kind of closed now but it's paved so we'll just uh, pull a UE in here it's a fun little airport that's the airport right there and believe it or not there's excellent Wi-Fi here there's the Stanhope Municipal Airport you can see the little uh, the windsock, and there's a Cessna. I'm just going to turn around here. Try not to hit any snowbanks. And there's a there's a chip chip truck that's here all uh, all summer. And so now we're heading back the way we came, and we'll just have a look at the airport here to the uh, to my left, and we'll end the video now. Have a great day.